From Chaos to Clarity by Optimizing Your Windows File System, I'm Huey Poplock. Keeping your files neat and tidy with these tips for naming and organizing them on Windows. Do you struggle to quickly find a specific file on Windows? One of the reasons could be that you're not naming your files correctly. It's essential to keep in mind specific rules before you begin naming files on Windows. To help you stay organized and prevent you from getting unpleasant surprises, I'm providing a list of important tricks you should know to name files on the operating system. Do not use any punctuation at the start of a file name. You are allowed to use a period and other supported characters like parenthesis, dash, commas, and underscore at the beginning of a file name. However, just because they are supported does not mean you should use them. You should always start your file name with the most important identifiers of the file, such as a date. Remember, when you sort your files by file name, Windows will arrange them in alphabetical slash numerical order, so think about how you can take advantage of that when naming files. 2. Do not use specific punctuation marks anywhere in the file name. While you can name a file the way you want, there are some limitations to what characters you can use. Windows operating system does not allow certain characters in file names which include the less than sign, greater than, the colon, the double quote, the forward slash, the backslash, the vertical bar or pipe, the question mark, or the asterisk. You can use spaces anywhere in the file name, but be mindful that the fact that some software does not recognize files with spaces. Instead of spaces, you can use underscores, dashes, and camel case. An example of camel case or file name together instead of the space between the word file and name. Keep your file name short and snappy. Windows 10 and 11 support up to 260 characters in a file name, meaning you can stuff many details into a file name. However, you should not aim to reach that 260 character limit. Ideally, a file name should not be longer than 35 characters. With all that said, sometimes it might be worth it to keep the file name lengthly. And if you think you benefit more from a long file name than a shorter one, you should not hesitate, but make sure it's unique and consistently structured. Don't use specific reserved words in file names. While naming files in Windows 11 and 10, you should keep in mind that you cannot use certain reserved words in file names. Here are the reserved words. On. PRN. AUX. NUL or NULL. COM0 through COM9. LPT0 through LPT9. It's also worth noting that the above reserved names followed by extensions are also not allowed to be used as file names. For instance, you cannot use null.txt or nul.txt as your file name. File names on Windows are case insensitive. Windows 11 and 10 do not require a correct input of uppercase and lowercase in file names, which means test with a capital T and test with a lowercase t are the same. When you use the same name for a file 
in the exact location, your PC will notify you that there is already a file with the same name. Your PC will also ask you if you want to rename the file to test followed by a number in the parenthesis. It's important to note that you can use the same name in files without numbers in the parenthesis as long as they are not in the same location. So, if you want to use the same name in files, you have to keep them in separate locations. Learn how to rename multiple files at once. If you think you are committing all sorts of mistakes while naming files on Windows and now want to fix your mistakes, you can easily batch file names using File Explorer, Command Prompt, or PowerShell. You can also batch rename the file extensions if you think you made mistakes there. You may want to use a third-party batch rename application. You can use emojis in file names to spice things up. One of the coolest ways you can name files on Windows is by choosing emojis instead of words. You can also mix words and emoticons if that works best for you. There is no limitation on using emojis anywhere in the file name. While emojis may not be highly beneficial, they can make file names more expressive if used properly. Include dates in file names to make them more descriptive. You can use dates in file names on Windows. Some of the most common ways to write dates are in the listed formats. However, you cannot use the format with slashes because the forward slash character is not supported in a file name. You can choose any format that suits you the best from the supported ones. But to ensure that you do not struggle with finding the exact file name, you should use the most significant date and time component first. If the year is your most important component, you should use that first, and also be consistent when you're using dates. Ensure your file names include enough context. Different people will likely have different opinions about what makes a suitable file name. But broadly speaking, a good file name is short but descriptive enough to help you quickly understand what's in it. If you have a PC for everyone in your family to use, you also need to name them in such a way that anyone else in your family can understand its content and context. In other words, if you're keeping the files for everyone to see, you should choose something that tells about the content it has. Search for the exact file using search syntax commands. To be able to find the exact file on Windows quickly is not as simple as you think. If you type something in the File Explorer search box, it will show a laundry list of files containing what you just typed. Thus, it makes things difficult for you to find the exact file in File Explorer. For example, if you're looking for a file called Windows.11 and want your PC to show you the exact file instead of a list of files with Windows and 11 in them, you can type name colon Windows.11 in the File Explorer search box. This will only show you the exact file you're looking for. Other than the name search syntax, some popular ones include kind, size, and date. If you type size colon 54KB in the File Explorer search bar, it will show you a list of files that are precisely 54 kilobytes in size. Everything by Void Tools is a powerful file search utility for Windows 
that allows users to quickly locate files and folders by name. It is known for its lightning fast indexing and search capabilities, able to index over 1 million files in just one minute. Everything provides a clean and simple user interface and supports advanced search features like Boolean operators, wildcards, and regular expressions. It can search not only file names, but also file attributes, metadata, and even file contents, though the content search is slower. Everything is a free, lightweight, and portable application that can be installed or run as a service to avoid UAC prompts. Overall, Everything is widely praised as one of the best file search tools available for Windows, offering an unparalleled speed and functionality. Get better file names on Windows with these tips. People often ignore the importance of getting file names right on their PCs. But with the tips that I just gave you, you can be a pro at naming files. It will take some time to get used to everything we just shared. And it's certainly worth remembering them because they can make you more productive and certainly help you create a more organized environment in File Explorer or any other third-party file management tool you may be using. From Chaos to Clarity, Optimizing Your Windows File System, I'm Huey Poplock. My thanks to Raul Nascar of MakeUseOf.com.